Can you synthesize this aldehyde starting with this molecule and an alkyne? Start with these two questions. One, what is the same? And two, what is different? The same is my cyclopentane with a methyl on it. What's different is they added a new bond, two new carbons, and the aldehyde. Knowing that this came from an alkyne, which is great for chain elongation, how can I get an aldehyde from an alkyne? Hydroboration. Telling me that one step back, I had my ring, that extra carbon, and the alkyne. And how did the alkyne get there? Through an SN2 reaction, which means I have to break this bond and give this carbon a leaving group, which means one step back, I had this thing with how about a bromine? Well, where did that bromine come from? If my starting molecule had nothing on it, I would have had to use the something from nothing synthesis pattern, which is radical halogenation. But the bromine would have gone here, which means I need my move the functional group pattern, a series of addition and elimination. So let's do a little bit of forward synthesis. I have my alkyl chain. Radical halogenation gives me a bromine at the most substituted position. Elimination with a big bulky base gives me a terminal alkyne, the Hoffman rather than Zaitsev product, which allows me to do radical halogenation for an anti-Markovnikov bromine on the primary position. So let's go back and fill in our reagents. We have our alkyl halide. We react it with Br2 in heat or light for radical halogenation and get our bromine at the most substituted carbon. React that with potassium terdbutoxide in terdbutanol on heat for the Hoffman elimination. React that with HBr and peroxides for the anti-Markovnikov halogenation. Finally, we bring in our NAC triple CH an acetylide anion for the SN2 reaction and react the terminal alkyne with B2H6 in THF followed by NaOH and H2O2 for the anti-Markovnikov hydroboration. This will give me an enol that will undergo ketoenol tautomerization for the aldehyde product. Comment final below for even more practice before your final exam.